Hello and welcome back to Spin Tires. I'm your host David in Ark and I am here with War Hero and today we're going to play some Spin Tires multiplayer and basically get stuck in the mud a lot, I'm sure. All right, I want a red limited. I have a feeling it is going to be interesting. And let's do hey, this. It wouldn't be fun if there wasn't something interesting happening. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> okay. And I can drive. Yay. The question is, can you drive? You got to get all your well, pieces and parts. There you start, go. I did. Hey, look there at there. You are driving. I move. I am driving. Now for this camera madness. Oh, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's not too bad for me because I am playing with the controller. Um, so it's kind of, at least with the joystick, I can manage. But if I, if, eh. Oh, that was weird. Could be here. Are, are you going to put anything on the Jeep or going to stay at stock? Oh, I, I'll just leave it stock. <laughs> I haven't got that far into the game to start messing okay. with stuff yet. <laughs> I guess I could. Okay, <laughs> uh, yeah, okay let's see here. Um, I guess we'll just go around and try doing the cloaking stuff on the map. Huh. That's cool. Um. Oh, I see. It's actually been a, quite a while since I've played these. Yep. All right. Yeah. So I'm, I guess uh, we can set our objective as uncloaking the map. Hey, there we go. That works. All right. I added a couple of things. I'm not exactly sure what. Some uh, a brush guard and some fog lamps and I don't know what. So anyway, we just screws. <laughs> yeah. There as we go. As long as not having a trailer, it shouldn't affect how it drives. <laughs> Trailers when it becomes fun. Yeah, I. There's, uh, there's actually a lot of maps that the uh, fun challenge is seeing if you can get through with the trailer. And well, and some of them, I mean, I can't even imagine. I mean, it's hard enough just to get through with a vehicle with no trailer attached. I can't imagine having a trailer <laughs> that you have to, you know, try to uh, yeah, negotiate. Yeah, we've. Um, One of the maps you'll have to uh, try one of these days is, I uh, can't remember the name off the top of my head, but it's very much, you were, uh, like, the, for the beginning, you were on a cliffside just going along trying to get down the mountain. Oh, my. And that one can be a fun one with the trailer. Oh, yeah. That one can be a scary one with even just a standard small trailer for these. So, uh, I think... Every time I've tried to do it, we end up ditching the trailer somewhere. <laughs> Mostly in a river. Normally in the river. It's there you after go. we get down the mountain that they cause a problem. <laughs> you know, this game has tons of fun hours and frustrating memories. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yes. Come on, come on. Go, 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 go. There we go. This is like one of those games you you I don't know what how do I want to say this you like you you hate to love it. <laughs> yes, very much so. Yeah, I have to say it's it is way more fun than I had thought it would be, which is part of why it took me so long to yes. buy it in the first place. You know, I'd watch folks like Tomcat mm -hmm. and some other folks play it, and I was kind of like, nah, I don't know about that. But man, once you get it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's it it is one of those games that you don't think it's gonna be fun, and then you uh, get it, and it's like, oh, what have I been missing? Yeah, exactly. I think um, me and a friend are always talking about this game with Beam and G's uh, physics. Oh man, would be interesting. That would be very cool. I would love to see because this. Because when you hit something. Mm -hmm. No, go ahead. <laughs> uh. Because the problem is when you hit something and do damage, you might see like it looks like it's trying to bend, but there is no actual damage. So it would be interesting to have, you go over rock, you can actually break your suspension doing it. Yes, yes. It'd definitely be interesting. 
Well, and I would love to see some of the the like this, you know, mud and water physics in Beam NG. Oh, that would be awesome. Oh yeah. Oh, come on, it come wants on. Me to cut through the woods. Oh, no, come, we'll take on. come on, come on. There we go. Yeah. yeah, the problem with these cloaking points, though, is sometimes the trails to them are not very good, and sometimes they're in the middle of the woods. <laughs> of course they are. Oops. Sorry, Can't tree. Get into hide to go across the. Uh, See, oh yeah, I forgot about it. There's no trail to it. There's no trail to it. Like, yeah, you just it's just there. Oh, that's it's cool. Kind of out here. Yeah. yeah. That's wow, cool. That, that did a big area. Oh, it sure did, man. It's up or down. Okay. So let me just see what this does. Oh, I don't know. It, it either glows or it doesn't. So <laughs> I have no idea. All right. Tell you what, I'll play a minute. Well, Let me see what should, happens. Uh, or I don't know how the gearing works as far as like individual gears, unless you've got like I use the racing wheel occasionally, which actually adds a six speed. But for this, I use the uh, I can use the joystick to move the gear stick around, and I uh -oh. know you can click. On the gear stick to move it. Oh, that's weird. Hmm. Yeah, I was just, I, I can't tell. I, I don't know which low and high. I think that's what it's doing is low and high, but I don't know. I don't know enough to. I'll figure it out. Anyway, <laughs> onward. <laughs> yeah. What happened to my. I had a marker going somewhere. All right. Get out of the way. Whoa. All right. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. When I when my when my I'm trying to when my gear shift is lit up, then yeah. it's high gear. So I I go way faster. So there we go. That's cool. Oh yeah. Yeah, some vehicles are different though. Sometimes automatic can get you going faster, and other times putting in the high is faster. Ah, okay. It can be it can be different, especially for mods. Wow, heck, this. Some of the transmissions for mods are uh, iffy. Whoa. To be able to actually take a trail. Yeah, that cloaking was right right next to the one we were just at, so that was easy. Well, it also seemed closer to the big field because it's not a, not a trail. Come on. Oh, trees. Oh, not good. These... Trees can be the most damaging item in the game. I usually manage to get high centered on the tree, like in the same direction the tree is going. <laughs> so that's, that's usually <laughs> my problem. <laughs> oh, there we go. No, oh, okay, I can't run over that tree. Oh. Sorry. Uh oh, come on. Go between. That'll work. Thank you. No, no, no. Let's go. Come on, come on, come on. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I just... Uh, that was operator headspace. I drove myself straight into the tree. Yeah, I did that too. Man. Alright, there we go. That water's not quite as deep as I was Oh, I love the effects in this game. It's so cool. Oops. Oh, you just undid cloaking. Okay, cool. 
Yeah, uncloaking this map is not going to take that long at all. <laughs> I just now realized this is not that big of a map. Hmm. Well, oh. we can still find other stuff. There's a tree there. Come on, go up, go up, go, 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 go. There is a tree sitting in that water. Oh, I see. In and it did damage when I touched it. Oh, well, I'm going to... It did gonna... damage when I touched it. It's not Yikes. ready for that. Well, thanks for the heads up. I went around it. <laughs> oh, that tree doesn't look very good, though. Oh, well, actually, that tree was more buried in the ground than I thought it was. Okay. Hmm. Come on. Come on, come on. Tearing it up, tearing it up. Oh, 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 oh. Out around the tree, thank okay. you. <laughs> oh, wow, I'm surprised it didn't give me a bunch of damage. I pretty much just, oh, high centered over. Sometimes it's the stupidest part that give you damage. Come on, oh, there we go. Man. Whoops. Let me get out of your way. We're going to go down this road. All right. And, you know, that, that kind of leads us in gently oh, into something if, whoops, if you decide we want to try something Mine. harder. Oh. Yeah, that's not quite as s solid as it originally looked. Oh, nope. I went for, uh, went for high and it tried to stall. Come on. Come on. There we go. Bridge. Oh, come on. Crazy truck. Oh. I thought I was just going to power through it. And then it <laughs> so much for that. Yeah, exactly. No, 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 no. Come on. What? What are you doing? There we go. Ah, man. Woo. Huh. I wonder if it's water. Well. No, this water is not a part of the trail. <laughs> <laughs> not going that All way. All I know is the cloaking was there, but... But the trail does not continue. <laughs> they just wanted you to get out in the middle of the water. Holy cow, that's pretty okay, deep. That's deeper, that's deeper than most yeah. of the streams I've gone through so far. Holy <laughs> cow. Your truck just, like, disappeared. I'm going to take a little higher okay. route. There we go. Wow. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, we should see. I might get her shoes wet. We'll be all right. Whoa! What the heck was that? That was weird. My uh, truck, my truck, I guess, hit a high spot in the middle of all of that water and decided it was going to spin out to the right. That was very strange. <laughs> Just one left, right? Yep. Cool. Yeah. Mm. Come on. Well, man, we just got the whole map on top. Mm. More mud. Yahoo! 
Oh. Hmm. I guess I need some gas at some point. Oh, that's cool. Uh, what that's, a, that's a neat little... Whatever what that... Is, what is your gas level at? Uh, let's see, I'm at 144 out of 750. Oh, red. Oh, it, you're it's, okay, you only it, start with 200. It's at red. It's, oh, I don't oh know well then, okay. Up with red because you only started with 200, so I don't know why that's oh. red. All right, well then, I don't feel so bad then. <laughs> yeah, the game only starts you out with 200. So. Oh, okay. Which, well, generally enough to get you anywhere and everywhere on most maps. I, I've only had a couple of custom maps where it actually got scary, where you had to watch how much fuel you were using. Oh, see, now that would be cool too. That's you know that'd be definitely part of the fun. Yeah. Ugh. Oh yeah, if you find a scary enough map, it it can be. I, I do remember a buddy of mine. We uh, I had I had a Cherokee. It wasn't that one. It was a different one. Pretty much almost out of fuel, and then he had a big like uh, six wheeled Mercedes. And he was almost completely destroyed damage-wise. We had to help each other to the end because I didn't have fuel to drive. And he couldn't take any bumps. <laughs> he couldn't take any damage. So oh, my a, gosh. Scary yeah, so it was, a, it was a scary trip. Let's see here. Hmm. Hey guys, David in ARC here, and uh, just wanted to jump in real quick. I'm going to divide this video up into at least two parts, just because uh, we played for uh, a really long time. And uh, so we're gonna, I'm going to end this part of things right here. Hope you uh, are enjoying the Spin Tires series. I've been having a blast playing with uh, some of you guys and uh, getting together and, and jumping into multiplayer and just... You know, playing around, figuring things out, it has been great. Uh, if you hit like the video, hit the like button, if you would. Feel free to leave any questions, problems, suggestions, horror stories down in the comment section below. Thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you next time.